All right, first thing I wanna say is thank you so much for the success of the last video. This was definitely by far my most successful 7DS video. Welcome to all the new subscribers and thank you for everyone who commented and asked questions. Uh, so I'm making a follow-up video because I've seen this question a couple of times now and it's actually, I've had trouble explaining it uh, without the aid of a video. So <clears throat> I'm gonna make a quick video today explaining it. So people have been asking me how to get these coins on the left-hand side, these ones over here. Uh, these are festival coins, uh, and you can use them to exchange for uh, Lost Van Meliodas, uh, Goddess Elizabeth, or the new Lilia. Now, I'm going to explain how you do that. So, first you need to understand a concept that is pretty common in gacha games. If you've never played them before, you may not under uh, you may not have heard the term. That's the term banner hero. So, the banner heroes for this banner are specifically New Wings King... Ashen Desire, Demon Hendrickson, Advent of Destruction, Lilia of Desire. So, the way that you get these festival coins is by pulling duplicates of those heroes. Now, I know there are other heroes listed on the banner, including Lost Vein, uh, Goddess Elizabeth, all these other SSRs that you see here. Those, if you pull them and they're a duplicate, will only give you a regular SSR coin. However, if you pull Ashen Desire, Hendrickson, Signs of Maturity, king or advent of destruction lilia and it's a duplicate your first one will always give you the hero any subsequent ones will give you that festival coin so then you can go back into your coin shop and you'll see that those coins will go up from one or from zero to one now i will say it may make sense to hold on since you're going to get a free hendrickson just from uh completing the missions so if you complete the missions, you get that Hendrickson, and if you were to draw Hendrickson, you would get a festival coin. Now, typically this is only going to be really helpful for whales because you would want a six star most of the heroes if you plan on using them. But if you're a collector like myself who really only wants a few key heroes, if I were to get multiple dupes, I would probably grab either additional Lost Fane Meliodas's or additional uh, Elizabeth's because they're part of my core team and I don't, I've only got one dupe of Meliodas and I've gotten zero dupes of Elizabeth. So for me, I would want to pull on this banner not only because I have a chance of straight up drawing those heroes, but because if I get duplicates of the banner heroes, I'm able to exchange them in the coin shop for Lost Vein and Elizabeth. One more thing about these festival coins, they can only be used on these festival heroes. Those will only come back when you have a festival banner like the one we're on now. So even if you draw dupes, say you draw one, right? You can't spend it on anyone, but you can't use it as an SSR coin either. So you wouldn't be able to use it on any of these other heroes in the shop. They can only be used on these event heroes when the event banners are present and they don't expire. So if you get a dupe from this event, but can't use it yet, the next time the event, uh, a new event comes around, you may be able to use it, uh, you may be able to gain more festival coins and use it in that subsequent event coin shop because these heroes will be coming back. Uh, this is a wonderful addition to the game, but I don't think it was explained very well. So I'm hoping that this clears up any of the confusion that is there. Uh, I had a hard time explaining this in the comment section, so it was just much easier for me to make a video of it. Um, I hope this makes sense for everyone with the visual. If it still doesn't, leave me a comment. Let me know. I am more than happy to try and explain it in a different manner. Uh, thank you again so much for watching. Welcome to the channel, and I will see you next time.